Kirby has some of the best continuity out of any Nintendo series, hands down. How can I make such a claim? Just look at these three idiots. This is Drossia, the final boss of Kirby's Canvas Curse, a spin-off game on the DS, and in the grand scheme of Kirby lore, this is like a nothing character. Until 10 years later in Triple Deluxe, they make the boss Paintria, whose description states that she was separated from her sister at birth, and both characters resemble each other and even have similar names. Then in Star Allies' soundtrack, there's a booklet where the two are drawn together along with the Vidria, which is a paint enemy also from Star Allies, and she's labeled as their youngest sister. Like, what? With these who? That's like if in Mario they made spiny, thoughtful, and I don't know, freaking Gooper Blooper all related. There's also this lunatic Krakow, a character that appears as a boss throughout multiple Kirby games. Now he might seem like a soulless eyeball cloud, but he actually remembers every single fight he's had with Kirby. In Kirby Fighters Deluxe, his pause description makes reference to fights with Kirby and Kirby's adventure, Kirby Superstar, as well as Squeak Squad. This eye has seen some things. 